Hey guys, back out in the woods. Cleansing some mushrooms. Yeah, it's the middle of June. We're still kind of in that uh, drier, lower elevation area I've been showing you guys for most of the episodes. Um, so the morels are pretty much done here. And the kings started on really strong, but usually when that happens, when they come on quick and fast, uh, that also means that they'll kind of peter out quickly, which seems to be the case. So uh, I've been hunting just by the road, which you can see is right over there, and just uh, driving from one spot to another. Um, there's a mountain in the background. I don't know if you guys can make that out. <clears throat> so we got some, a large fur there, there. It's a big one here. There's a really nice one up there. So sure enough, right by him, found this still, I mean, it was obviously damaged a bit by uh, an animal, but still really, still really tight button. And this is actually a butter bully, which come a little bit after the kings. They kind of intersect with their seasons. And you can see it has, um, Has a more of a yellow stipe. Um, light, kind of minimal reticulation. Um, mostly yellow pores to start off with. And this one does stain blue. As you can see some of these nicks here. Uh, but the blue does fade after some time and it doesn't come on immediately. It's like some of the other bolites do. Alright, so the other distinguishing feature of these butter bolites is that the bottom of the stipe here is actually kind of like a pink color. Might be able to see that just under that dirt. Let's see if I can cut that away. You can see it's kind of um dull pink tan color and there's the staining yeah so this one's gonna be good um, in my opinion they're just as good as the Kings maybe a little less flavorful but really firm texture so yeah, let's look around for more. All right, so I found that first one right here. I've already spotted, I think, another one over here. Yep. It's growing out of the hillside here. Looks like part of it's been eaten too. Oh. But still a nice base, nice stem there. Okay, so that's good. So look around for more. Check in this direction. What is that? So that's, uh, yeah, that's the stipe of one. The rest of it's been eaten. You can kind of see that pink tint there. Okay. So, one here. 
One there, one there. Some more disturbances here. See all this stuff here? Oh, see that? I bet that was one there as well. Yeah, that was a big one. So it's just what's left. Used to be, you know. Oh, walked right by it. Much more obvious from this angle. So again, something started to chew on it. Even started to clean it up right here. <laughs> well, it's still nice and firm in the ground. And uh, the kind of the key to getting these out is not to grab it on the underside and get them pores dirty, but to kind of hold it like this and wriggle it back and forth a little bit until it comes out. Nice. So I'll let that one dry out a little bit. Okay. So we got kind of a general trend here. Let's keep going downhill. Much easier to hunt uphill usually. Closer to the ground. Can see things at a better angle. Let's see, let's see. So yeah, I think I might come out maybe one time after this, but this can be one of the later ones. I'm still only at about you know 3,500 to 3,000 feet of elevation, so there's much higher elevation spots that will go on into June and maybe even July this year because uh, right now some of them still have snow on believe it or not oh right here look at this it's probably an old one though yeah just kind of squishy Okay, so one there. Okay, so there's another set of really nice fur over there. But before I get too far, I probably want to loop back around. Double check this spot. About that. What about this? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like a, an archaeological excavation, like that first scene in Jurassic Park. Okay, so this is a uh, Rex Ferris. So this is interesting. You can see the two are just right next to each other. Um, biggest difference is the white stem. Uh, more reddish top. Larger uh, or longer, I should say, stipe. Often club footed like this. What did you have in there? Okay, so yeah, there's its little aborted brother. So that's quite interesting. So 
definitely be, have to be a spot I remember for next year.